Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today I am here to talk with you about Scentbird. No, I am not the last one to this parade. So I have seen it around for quite a while. I did see it around for quite a while. I tried probably I would say about maybe four months ago to subscribe to it. I did all my information, put in my credit card, did all that kind of stuff, and for some reason it never came. I didn't really think anything about it because I was in the middle of moving and stuff like that, so I just kind of let it go. I was never charged for it. I'm not sure what happened because I still get the like emails from it. But anyways, I signed up again, and this time it actually came. So I have no idea what happened the first time, but I've been very excited to try this because this has been all the rage kind of talk. Like, if you want to try new perfumes, but you don't really want to just buy a bottle without knowing if you really like it, you don't want to necessarily go and go to Sephora and Ulta and pay for the roller balls or the sprays because they kind of tend to be expensive. They're about $28 usually. Um, for most perfumes, I would say anywhere from $20 to $28. And although, yes, it does last you a little bit of time, and then if you like it, you can go buy the big size, I feel like it's a bigger investment. Um, Scentbird is $14.99, I believe, a month. You get to try different samples. So you get the container, it comes in, you can throw this in your purse, it's nice and safe because until you pull this up, it won't actually spray. So that's really nice. You can easily just replace these um, or replace what's in your canister. You can use it all up one month, not use it all up one month. Um, I think this is a great way to go when you're not sure about a perfume, but you don't wanna make a large investment just yet until you know and they also have things that come out every month of perfumes that they recommend for you depending on which scents that you choose for october for example it says commodity commodity um gold october fragrance of the month a sexy decorative fa fragrance is pure and liquid luxury it has bergamot juniper vanilla molten amber and uh, nubian musk so there's all kinds of different ones that come out things that they recommend, things that they can tell by your scent profile, what you like. Also, it's not just cheap perfume. You know how you think, okay, well, they're probably giving you perfume that's, you know, doesn't really cost a lot of money or whatever. No, there's actually some really expensive perfumes on there that you can choose to be your monthly sample. So this month for my first one, I decided to get the Michael Kors Glam Jasmine. I love Michael Kors original. The sexy amber is beautiful as well, but the original one is my absolute all-time favorite. And it comes in this nice little black bag if you wanna keep that in your purse as well. So you just twist it up, then the sprayer is here, you spray it. I'm going to spray mine. And this smells divine like i probably will be buying myself a full size of this it smells so good you can definitely smell the jasmine in there but it has almost like that same background note of the original michael kors oh it smells so good oh my gosh this smells really good like i can't stop smelling it the jasmine in there is very prominent and I really like that. So it's just a very jasmine-y scent, but it's like a nice, like soft, sexual, like musk behind it too. Oh, it smells so good. I'm really, really happy with this. Okay, noted for my Christmas list that I want this one now, but I mean, you, as you can see, you get a very large container of it. It's definitely gonna last you the whole month unless you go like crazy. Or you can also choose to keep them in these and get more of the containers. They come in all different kinds of colors. Easy to pop in and out and replace, easy to store. I love the idea of this a lot and I'm really happy with this. I am definitely gonna get this. It smells amazing. I feel like I know this smell though. I feel like I feel like it smells like something I have that's similar, but it doesn't smell the same. Like it almost kind of smells a little bit like the Taka Florence perfume, just a little bit. Oh, it just smells so good. I really, really like this. You have to go try this and smell it. Get your own scent bird, pick your scent. Don't forget, it's not just for women, it is for men and women. Sometimes they have unisex smells as well. 
So go get your little scent bird for yourself and don't be the last one. <laughs> I will leave all the information down below for you so you can go get your own. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you all in my next video. Bye guys.